Libertarian Ron Paul and his son are in Austin, exciting his hundreds of supporters with a rally at the state capitol this afternoon. The presidential candidate is the last challenger to remain in the contest for the Republican nomination. Fox 7's Camille Williams joins us live from the capitol. Camille? Jenny, the National Tea Party Express, they sponsored this rally, and they were expecting a large crowd. They say at least 2,000 Ron Paul supporters showed up today, and the Texas congressman, his son, Rand Paul, a Kentucky senator, and Ted Cruz running to replace U.S. Senator Kay Bailey Hutchinson were all speakers at the rally today. Most of the people in the crowd were here to see presidential hopeful Ron Paul. Just this morning, the libertarian-leaning congressman found out he grabbed most of the delegates in Maine and Nevada, trumping the presumptive GOP nominee Mitt Romney. Although Paul hasn't won any caucuses or primaries, it really all comes down to who has the most delegates in order to win the nomination. Paul was full of energy and confident today in his speech. Take a listen. There is every reason to be optimistic about way things are going, but not to be complacent. To be complacent means that we wouldn't be here and we wouldn't be concerned. We wouldn't be trying to get Ted in there to help Rand and all these things. So uh, there's there's reason to be optimistic, but it's ideology that is important. Uh, the one individual can't do it. You have to have you have to have support. Again, he and Mitt Romney are the last two GOP candidates standing. Paul has vowed that he will not be dropping out of the race. He plans to make it all the way to the National GOP Convention in Tampa, Florida in August. We're going to have much more from the Ron Paul, Ron Paul rally tonight at 9. Jenny? Camille, thank you.